Despite TMZ reports that rock and roll pioneer Jerry Lee Lewis has died, Jerry Lee Lewis is still alive. The story sparked a wave of grief before being removed from the site on Wednesday. He's alive. TMZ falsely reported anonymous and bullshit information. A rep for Lewis told Variety, Lewis is known to have had the flu this month. He was unable to attend his October induction into the Country Music Hall of Fame. 16, where his wife accepted the honor in his place, so saying he is alive and well might be overstating one of those two things. But TMZ acknowledged they gotten a bum tip on a supposed passing. Earlier today we were told by someone claiming to be Lewis Rep that he had passed, TMZ said in revising its article. That turned out not to be the case. TMZ regrets the error. Quad. A photo was posted after the Hall of Fame induction ceremony of Chris Christopherson visiting the flu-stricken Lewis at home to personally present him with his medallion. Lewis' false reporting is the second time in recent weeks that a major music personality has been falsely reported dead after People magazine published an article and tweeted that Joni Mitchell had died. Was easily spotted as a mistake by readers as it contained a TK in the story and headline to indicate that a space had to be filled in before the obituary was published. Her concerts despite staying away from her scene, Lewis traveled from Memphis to Nashville in May when the Country Hall of Fame winners were announced, posed for photos, and attended press conferences. I feel much better. Beyond her Hall of Fame honors, Lewis will soon be celebrated more in Trouble in Mind, a documentary about rockers directed by Ethan Cohen. The document doesn't have a projected release date, but it was lauded when it